Hey everyone, it's Fantasia. Welcome back to another Sims 4 discussion video. So this one is a quick one, but it's Monday and that means tomorrow is usually the day that the Sims team will go ahead and make an announcement. So I want to talk a little bit about that. We're actually going to look at the roadmap again. I looked at that recently in another video, but the roadmap kind of explains the title of this video. So before we get into everything, let's go ahead and do our notification shout out. And this one goes to Becky Martin. I love, love, love this comment. So I've been telling you guys to comment down below when you started playing The Sims, what one was it, Sims 1, 2, 3, 4, how old you were, like any memories you had. I've been saying that in some of my discussion videos. And the stories that I'm getting from you guys, oh my gosh, I just love it. Like I always love going through my comments, but especially right now, I am like obsessed with looking through my comments because this is so much fun. Like, I don't know. It's so interesting hearing all of your guys' stories, but when you got into the game. So to Becky's comment, I absolutely love that you started playing shortly after the Sims 4 was released and you're 38 now so then you were like in your late 20s right since it is about to be the nine year anniversary for the Sims 4 so that's really cool that you got into it then because a lot of people they'll find the Sims when they're really young but I can only imagine finding the Sims like in my 20s I oh my gosh a whole other world would have opened up for me because I just feel like as you get older you actually start to appreciate the game even more and you like make more memories with it whereas like when I started playing the Sims 1 I was only six and so I don't really like I know I loved it, but it's like, I don't remember that many things about it. Obviously, you know, I've had my memory refreshed from Sims 1 videos and stuff like that, but <laughs> like, I didn't go back and play it later, really. So a lot of my memories are from the Sims 2 days when I started to get a little older, but especially the Sims 3 when I was a teenager. So yeah, I feel like finding this game in your 20s all the way at the fourth generation is pretty cool. So anyways, also, yes, I love how the Sims just takes you away from reality and I feel like that's the best part about it and that's why so many people love The Sims. Also, thank you so much. I'm so glad you love my videos and if you guys want a chance to be in a notification shadow, all you gotta do is comment down below. Okay, so as I said, Tuesdays are usually announcement day, so I'm assuming they're gonna announce the two kits and then they're gonna release on Thursday. So I think I mentioned this a little bit briefly already in another video, but I want to talk about more about what I think these kits are gonna be. I think everyone is assuming they're gonna be swimwear kits or a swimwear kit for Create a Sim. Um, which I do think so too, based on this roadmap. So let's go ahead and look at this together. So uh, when I was going through this in another video, I was like trying to find the fairy and stuff and like trying to find any other hints that people have been seeing. And yeah, I, I keep getting comments saying there's a fairy in the tree and I thought it was here, which doesn't really resemble a fairy, but like it looks like a person with hair right here. But then I was like, okay, there's nothing like, this might be nothing first of all, but also not to mention there's nothing specifically that's like, like fairy. It's just, that's all I could find. But then you guys told me it's over here and there's like this fairy wing. Do you see that? Do you guys see that now? Like again, maybe it just looks that way, but like now that I see it, I can't unsee it. So <laughs> Like, what the heck? So now I'm like, okay, hold on. If this is in the roadmap, that makes me think this and more is going to be them announcing fairies. So I think the reason, you know, it's not listed because, you know, they always tell us what we're getting right? As far as the packs that are going to be released within this time. But if a game pack is just going to be announced, then they wouldn't put game pack on here, right? Because it's not going to be released in this time frame. So I'm like, hmm, okay. Like now I'm just convinced they're going to announce fairies and then maybe fairies will release in like October or something. So anyways, back to the kits. So these two bold kits, we know there's swim trunks over here. If you don't know this, then I kind of talked about this recently, how there's swim trunks here. There's sunglasses in the tree over here. Here. there's a floaty right here and then there's a chair here I don't know if there's anything else that's like obvious but those are like the obvious things that I saw that this also looks like something but like I don't know exactly it just looks a different shape compared to all these so that's why I'm assuming this is something um, but you guys, so I'm speculating that we're going to get a swimwear create a sim kit, which is what a lot of people think. Then we'll get a build kit. And you know, I actually think it's going to be a pool kit. Like I could be wrong. Like I know we're not going to get any new gameplay because we don't get gameplay kits, but I just, I don't know why I think this. Cause you know, 
everyone's guessing they're going to be summer kits. You know, we're coming close to the end of the summer now. It's cutting it close. That's why I think they're going to announce it tomorrow and then release it on the Thursday, which is how they always do kits anyways. But I feel like if they wait another week, that'd be very odd if it's like summer swimwear related. And you know, I feel like this is a dead giveaway for as far as the Curtison kit. And then just because of this, I guess this could be still hinting at this, at like a swimwear Curtison kit, but I feel like there has to be a build by kit hints in here as well. Like there's this chair here, right? But it's like, okay, what does that really tell us? <laughs> because like, it's just a chair. Like I feel like every single build kit includes a chair almost. Maybe not like the clutter kit, but like most of them include a chair. And so... <laughs> I'm just like, okay, this doesn't really tell us a theme. The legs on this chair, like, I don't know, this chair could be like an indoor chair, but it could also be an outdoor chair. Like if you think about it, because of the legs, a chair for indoors could have this type of leg too, but I don't know. This is making me think it's for the backyard or something because of this floaty. So I'm like, oh, are we going to get like an outdoor summery backyard kit? I think that'd be so cute. I would actually really thoroughly enjoy that because I'm really not a kit person, but I do really feel like we need more swimwear for sure. And then I feel like we need more backyard summery stuff. And it's like, would they put pool floaties in a kit though? That's something I'm unsure about because then, well, I think, yeah, because obviously it's not gameplay. Like we already have floaties in the game and that's just, it's something your Sims just like lay on or sit on. So I was like, okay, like maybe we're going to get some of that type of stuff for the pool. That would be so fun. I would love that. It would kind of like make me feel like there's gameplay, which some kids kind of do that. Like the build by kits, there's like certain functional items, obviously, that your Sims can use. And then of course, obviously they give new beds, chairs, which obviously your Sims can use all those things, but it's not giving us new gameplay per se. But yeah, you guys, I just have this weird feeling. So that's going to be my guess. Comment down below what you guys think. Do you think they're both going to be summer related? Because I just think so. If you guys have any other ideas of what they could be, please let me know down below. I just feel like based off these hints here, that's what it's going to be. Otherwise, I have no idea what the point of this is. Because <laughs> even if this is hinting towards the creator of some swim work it if that's what it's gonna be which I'm like 99% sure I'll be completely shocked that's not what it is I think everyone will be but yeah if this is just a hint towards that I just feel like that's like misleading for a hint this would be like a build by object not a create some object again I don't know if I see anything else here like I feel like there's definitely probably other hints in here that we're not seeing. So if you guys want to go ahead and take a look, of course, feel free to do so and comment down below other things you may have spotted. There could be other things for the kits in here. You know what's weird? Now that someone showed me that like this is the part that looks like a fairy, I feel like I'm just seeing a thousand fairy wings. Like, <laughs> And it's probably not, but I feel like I see wings here. I feel like I see a wing here. Like, I just feel like I'm seeing so many wings. But like, these might not be. What if this is something else? This looks weird now to me. Like, the more that I look at it. You guys, I've never had so much fun looking through a roadmap before. <laughs> like, like, is there more things in these branches? Like, I just, I don't know. I wish there was, I know, obviously, they're going to try to really hide some things in here. But I wish some of the things were just as obvious these, as these sunglasses. Because this is just like a dead giveaway. But yeah, this for sure has to be a wing. This is something that I was like, is that something or no? I don't, I'm not sure. But anyways, you guys, definitely keep your eye out for an announcement tomorrow. Of course, I'll do a video. My video will probably go up a little bit after The Sims makes their tweet, of course, and then I guess we'll find out. Also comment down below if you have no interest in like swimwear summertime kits, let me know because I actually think that's something I'd be interested in and it's something we don't have enough of. So with that said, I'm gonna go ahead and just wrap up this video here. Again, I just wanna thank you guys so much for your comments lately. They are are making my day. You guys are amazing. I love hearing your stories and I just feel like the comment section has become this very cozy little corner of just sim stories and I love it so so much. It's literally serotonin. So with that said you guys I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this up here. I hope you all enjoyed it because you're having an amazing day and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys!